Take a look at your cabinets. One, two, three. <laughs> I'm Erica and I love to cook and do it professionally, but I hate my pantries. Food is one of the most important things in my life. Everything about it is positive except this very stressful aspect that is my pantry. So I just like to mitigate that and make it all a very happy experience for me when I'm cooking. everybody, it's Ashley, it is a new day. We are here in a very stuffed car. Hi Taylor. Hi. And we have lots of camera and uh, equipment and things and Tarn is in the front seat. Hi Tarn. Hi. Hang on, oh wait, give us a hi. <laughs> um, so we are on our way to Erica's apartment. I am so excited because uh, I'm just in the mood to organize. It's a beautiful day, there's a lot of stuff to organize and I'm ready to get it done, so let's do it. Okay, I am so excited to get to organizing today. This is a gift you're giving to me that I get to organize all your spices today. This is very fun for That's me. That's good news <laughs> for me. It is not my ideal job or day spent by any means. I have to say, surface level, this is a gorgeous kitchen. Thank you. I'm like hiding my secret shame in there. So. <laughs> no, it can't be that bad. Wow, this is a lot of food. All right, Erica is on her way to see her mom and we have to get started because we don't have that much time today uh, and we do have a lot of work to do. Black sesame seed? What? I didn't even know these seasonings existed. I have to say, she did a pretty good job of fitting a lot of stuff into a small space, but uh, I think she forgot some of this is in here. But we're gonna make it so that she can see everything and that she can access everything. So let's do it. <laughs> okay. Let's do it slowly. <laughs> Much better. You have all the food items out and there's some duplicates, there's some empty containers, and some just mysterious items, which, I don't know, wait, I actually think this is garlic powder, hang on. Oh, yep, definitely garlic powder. Uh, so yes, unlabeled things, empty things, duplicates, kind of half open, susceptible to little critters uh, packages, so. That's where we're at right now. It's kind of organized. I'm not gonna go too crazy with making these piles perfect because we're just gonna end up putting them back in there and rejarring things. But I do just wanna go through now and get rid of things we don't need. Now I'm going to clean the inside of the cabinets. I don't think people realize how gross they really get and it's nobody's fault. It's the kitchen, things get dirty, but they definitely need to be cleaned. So what I'm gonna do is do one part water, one part vinegar, and then drop in a few orange peels to just have an all-purpose cleaner. I'm gonna use this now to just give a little scrub down on the cabinet so that we can get to organizing. All right, now it is time to start putting things in jars. I'm very excited for it to be a beautiful uniform cabinet space. And Erica did say that she wanted jars that had attached lids. And I agree with her because it's just one more thing to lose. If the lids are detached, you put it in the dishwasher, somebody else empties it, and then you never see the lid again. So I prefer these kind of jars. They also suction shut. And that's just my hot take and Erica's hot take. So buy what jars you like, but I like the ones with the lids attached. that a lot of people miss is that you can adjust where the shelves are within the cabinets to really fit the jars that you have and to make sure that the things you're using most frequently are closest to you.
we're gonna open all the cabinets. Mm. <laughs> One, two, three. Oh, oh my god! Oh my god! This will change the game for me, 100%. Good. Yeah, thank you so much. It's everything I dreamed of and more. Oh. Yeah, I'm really, <laughs> I'm like very excited to cook tonight. I really feel like I'm moving on to this next chapter of my life. I'm gonna be cooking professionally and now I have the pantry to match that. So Yay. thank you.